Hello everyone and welcome to a new series we're going to be running for at least a short time. Uh, this is Beacon. Uh, I got linked to this on Itch and it looks to be, firstly, pretty damn pretty, and secondly, pretty damn interesting. It's a bit of a rogue light action shooter um, where you're a brand spanking new clone that uh, comes out of one of these pods and uh, gradually as you move around the procedurally generated maps kill monsters and things you find bits of DNA which you can use to augment future clones of yourself. Um, I think the game is probably going to explain itself a little bit to us as we go through the tutorial so we're going to do that now and uh, we're going to see exactly how this plays. Now I believe it can be played with a controller but I'm going to be doing it with keyboard and mouse. So our ship has crashed uh, Ouroboros is the name of the ship. It's sustained heavy damage. There's hostile life forms on the planet. There's no distress signal. The pilot is dead. And this is us. Right, so we can get the map. And we need to get over to here. So WSAD moves us around. Oop. We can hop down. down. So down here we've got a plasma pistol and grenades. Uh, that's right trigger, which is actually left mouse button, I believe. And G for the grenade. Let's uh, hop down again. Ow! Okay. Definitely don't get hit by things like that. And it looks like we can walk off the edge, so let's not do that either. Oh, that's, that's pretty. Look at that. All right, let's uh, dodge roll through the fire. All right, we're on fire. Hopefully that's not going to last forever. And we've got a Viper assault rifle. We understand the demand of today's interplanetary corporation. Sometimes just, blah, 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 blah. diplomacy just doesn't work out. Merge gone south, buy with cold feet. Ex-CEO, not quite as retired as you'd like. Brilliant. Whatever the reason, make sure your enforcement teams are armed with the best. Kaiser Schmidt Viper assault rifle boasts an industry-defining rate of fire. <laughs> Brilliant. Okay, so... It's automatic, which is good. Low accuracy, which I'm assuming is bad. And we've got some kind of index entry. All right, yeah, so we can we can have a look at this. So the pistol is semi-automatic, high accuracy, but low damage. This is low accuracy, but fully automatic. Well, that's cool. Fire weapon. Oh, right. Ah, they can shoot back. All right. Switch weapon. Uh, and swap weapon with left control. Okay, so we can cycle between the two of them there. Uh, can we... We can reload by pressing R. Okay, that's good. Uh, let's go off the edge here. Use grenade box. Ooh, grenade box. Uh, right, that's filled our grenades. Throw grenade. Ooh. Now, what we did miss, I'm counting that as a hit. Melee. That was slightly better. Okay, so we're going through here. Use crate. And we've got a crate down that way. What's this pistol like? That's not too bad as far as rate of fire goes, but I'm going to keep to the assault rifle for the moment. Ooh, what are these? Uh, so that was probably some healing. Uh, we've got a flare shot though. Explodes on impact, chance to ignite enemies. Okay. Uh, all right, that's down in the bottom left. So that's a Q to use that. What's this here? That looks like a different weapon. Ooh, is this like a secret area? That, that looks like a the happy face. Uh, oh, do we want a ball buster instead of the assault rifle? You know what? Let's let's take the ball buster instead of the plasma pistol. So the MGTX ball buster tungsten, as some will say, <laughs> it was known in ancient Earth mythology as metal and have got what metal of the gods. Well, we can't begin to understand the mysterious ways of our 21st century ancestors. We do know that they were onto something here. Magrail blaster uses high grade tungsten. For Concentrated. Is it a sh semi automatic shotgun? Oh, jeez. I think I'm gonna like this. 
Only has three shots on it, though. Wait, did we... Did we destroy part of that dude there? The reload's not too bad. On, oh, we've got to load individual shells into it. That could be problematic. Alright, we don't take any falling damage at least. Uh, activate the... Oh, that's the uh, the thing that we got. So, let's flare this guy. Okay. Well, that was straightforward enough. Ah, it's single use though. Dodge roll. Across that, that's... Okay, we can we can try better. We lost a little bit of health. Okay, that sort of works. Um, right, so detonator up here. Activate detonator. Detonator down here. It's pretty intuitive as far as the uh, the gameplay goes, and the controls feel pretty spot on. Like if you're running backwards, you move slower than if you're running forwards. Uh, things kind of move how I would expect them to. Um, let's have a look at the map. So we need to go this way, but there's nothing for us to do this way yet. Aha, uh -huh, what have we got? A barrage. It's an auxiliary. Releases a barrage of five missiles. Okay, that's appeared on our C key. Activate auxiliary. Ah. ah, that's a mistake. Okay, we can just like hit them right in the face with this. Oh no, no, our power-ups are being blasted around. Volatile DNA, plus 44 stamina. That's plus stamina and luck. That's plus luck and minus speed. Okay. So it looks like there may be a bit of compromise with some of the DNA bits that we find. Beacon locator. Okay, and and the simulation. Okay, so that was relatively straightforward, but the game is not going to be as nice to us with that. So, what did we get? Minus health plus to resist. Minus speed. Right, so this is a good solid one. Uh, we could just, like, massively put our luck up. I wonder what our stamina is primarily used for. Probably dodge rolling. You know what, Let, let's, let's put our resists up as well. So, we were a bit less healthy, but we've got higher resists, higher stamina, and a lot higher luck. I think that should be fine. Okay. Mutation detected. Rejected arm. Your body restricted to one-handed weapons. Reduced accuracy, but plus 40 speed. Ooh. Okay. <laughs> plus 35 armor against all damage types. Okay. Big tungsten thing. So we've got two mutations. And the rest of it seems to have gone fine. This is, and this is where the the game's going to change more than. Ah, uh, oh, this is so cool with all the sequencing. And um, as uh, you load in different DNA, you can mutate, as we've just seen, and that will create many more possibilities. Oh yeah, yeah, that that hand is uh, is pretty boned. So we've got a plasma pistol. We are a lot faster. Okay, where are we going? Let's go this way first, I think. H2O tanks. Alright. Is there any reason for... I suppose I can't pick it up. Even if I wanted to, because I don't have the, uh, the extra thing. Let's inspect that. Hmm. Okay, well, let's uh, let's push on and see what we find. 
always feeling a little bit cautious about these things. So there is an ancient fossil. It's definitely something around this way. Oh my word. Nope. I'm, I'm just going to say all of the note to that. So I think we can heal from these. Oh my god, there's little, little things, alright. Don't stop shooting until they're all dead. We do have grenades, we've got to remember that. Oh, I wish I had more than eight bullets. No! Nope. Damn it. We'll pretend that didn't happen. Ah, cool, we can kill those. And we've been slimed, which I think means we're taking damage over time, or we're slowed. So, Illuminated Spalling is a pickup. 100% critical chance, 8 second duration. So, this is going to be, yeah, something that we can use with our Q key. So, useful for emergencies. Let's uh, see if we can destroy this. Yeah, we can. That's good. At least I'm assuming it's good. Seeing as this is like a one-way area, I want to check this way first. Let's reload. What do we got? This doesn't look ominous at all. No siree. Something died there. Okay, well that's healed us up a little bit. Oh dear. Can, can, can you say trap? I can. Trap! Uh, I don't think we can get up there as much as I want to. No. Kill the big things. Kill the little things. Kill everything is, is basically the way we're going with this. Okay, I think we're safe to, to head back at least. I'm gonna watch out for those little... Hey! No! Don't, don't be sure to me! Uh, right, which way do we want to go? Uh, kind of want to check down this way, but I worry that if we go... Oh no, we can climb back up this bit, I believe. I get the feeling this is where things are about to get a bit more... Ah, it's biting my face! I can't see! Okay, well we've got some more DNA for the next run. I don't know whether we get to reuse the DNA or if it all gets used up. There's something up there that we want to get to. Now, as far as I know, there's no points or anything like that. So, we just need to really think about... How are we going to get up there? Maybe there's a... Climbing thing? Or we could throw a grenade to open it up? I don't see any indication that there's anything like that though.
And as far as I know, this screen can't be rotated. Let's... Let's pull down this way. I'll just have a look in case there's anything that I missed. No, it's not looking... Not looking promising like that. So maybe it's just something we have to shoot from over this side. Oh, yeah. I think we're hitting it. I'm with a aiming aside is very difficult to to tell precisely. Oh no. Maybe we've waited too long. Right, so we've got a hive swarm. Because uh, I used our pickup that we had before. Uh, releases a swarm of hatchlings. Well, that seems pretty straightforward. Okay, we're, we're going we're gonna to push on. I think it's not worth us sticking around and messing with that too much. Let's uh, try and keep making progress. Okay, that, that's some kind of shield thing. Right, he's dead. That one's dead. Taking a little bit of damage. I don't know if that was just more ammo. Oh, that was a grenade. Man, our accuracy really sucks with this. I mean, their accuracy is not brilliant. Okay, can't open any of these. Let's at least get reloaded. Hmm. Lots and lots of crates. Right, let's bring up the map. Uh, I think we're going to have to go in this way. Yeah, that's fine. Now, all these levels are, as I mentioned before, procedurally generated. So next time, we're going to get a completely different map. What's that? I swap the hive swarm for a raptor egg. Ooh. Uh, you know what? Let's let's use the hive swarm, and we'll pick this up so that at least we get the information on it. Oh my word! Can't shoot my own ones. I don't know what that was, but I get the feeling it was going to try and explode at us. Now, there was something this way. Something up there. Is this a teleporter? Or like a bouncer or something like that? Can, can, I, can I hit you? Don't know. Woo! That worked. That's a lift. We never did check out what that ancient fossil was. So that's another boost pad. Okay, let's let's activate the lift and we'll see what happens. Ah! This brings us specifically to an equip- Oh! An equipment stock area which is guarded. Of course it's guarded. I mean, what would you expect? Sentry turrets as well. Good to know. Okay. Do we have a, an internal- No, we don't have an internal map. Again, getting the feeling that, you know, people are- 
flinging grenades at us. Not a good place to be. Ah, uh, yes. So stamina is for dodge rolling. You can see down in the uh, the bottom left, as I do that, there's uh, little status indicators that uh, that decrease. I think there was actually something in there that I killed. Let's do the other one. Just to make sure. Last thing we want is to get whatever this equipment is and then Hollow Shield Drone. Befriend drone with the Hollow Shield Slice. Cool. Well, that's a new passive. Ah, oh, look at this! Oh my god, we've got a friend! Can I can I shoot through it? I can shoot through it. Okay. A friend drone is now the best. Yeah, so I reckon those would have popped up. Ah. Okay, we're still fine. We're still fine. We've got like 61 health. I mean, this is still really early in the game, of course. God, jeez. Let's get a grenade in there. Yeah, you guys done? All this with a pistol. Yeah, that's where they would have come out of. So we're going to have to get back up top, which I think was this way. Bounce. And back out we go. Hey, a worthwhile excursion. Uh question is, which is the... Ah, this is the way down. Or up higher. Nope, down. And in here... Ooh, a Tesla injector. Let's pick it up. In fact, we'll, we'll use the egg. And... Let's have a look on the map. There is still that fossil down this way. So let's go off the edge. And we will... Kill these guys. Oh my god. Like, just give it up already. Was it... Was it this? Or was it... Ah! Right down here. Is it a specific thing to uh, to look at? All right. Well, it's been crossed off, so we've uh, we've discovered it. Let's carry on to the exit. For a first level, not too difficult as of yet. We do still have a long way to go, though. I do like that it gives you a proper indication of how far there is uh, left. Oh. Um, sure. Reinforcement crates. I will always take them as long as they don't hit me in the face. Uh-oh. And this will be why. Let's get another grenade in there. Okay, don't want to be near their grenades, of course. Ah, did he just blow himself up? I kind of like that, and it worries me that I'll be able to do that myself. Volatile DNA. Uh, yeah, we'll get a little bit of healing. And we used a grenade, so we can actually get this. Is that it for fools that were trying to kill us in here? I think so. Okay, next ones. Not seeing anything there. Although, it does have like an indicator. Can we... We can open it up. A flame pistol! Oh, it's... 
this is this is my new favorite. It's a one-handed weapon. That's the the best. The best thing. Now there was something moving in there, so you know, taking no chances. Got to wait for the fire to die down before we go in. No, nothing to loot inside. That's all right. Let's reload this. I'm, I have to say, I'm I'm loving the gameplay and I'm loving the aesthetic of this. That looks like the exit. Is it safe to go? It might be. Alright, just before we do, let's, uh, there is a tiny bit more of the map just up this way. But we can't actually go that way. It's just for visuals. Okay, well, I think that'll do. Secrets discovered 0%. Explosives will break loose basalt forms. So that's something we could definitely try and work with. Oh, I see. It automatically moved us on. Okay. Well, I think we saw a secret beforehand. It's just we didn't actually go back for it. Right. Okay. Person logged. What? Okay. Uh... Phew! Okay, so I thought this might be a bit rough when I set out, but this is kind of chaos, and I have people saying nothing could have prepared me for this. I literally died crash landing here, and I was still unprepared. Got here though, it seems like things are calming down a bit, so I took the opportunity to set up a small camp and recuperate. Things are currently working in my favour, I'm making progress. The beacon locating is actually working. I stayed alive for two consecutive days. No things to worry about though, the landscape seems like it's changing as I get further from the ship. Those bogs were already all over the place before, but here it looks like this is their territory. They don't just hang around here. They've actually started building. Ah. Okay. Good to have extra information. So there's a Solus Hive. Uh, Solus is one of the creatures. And there's uh, two other things at least. I want to try out this flame pistol. Let's find something to shoot. I wonder if that's a loose formation. No, that's just a regular tree. Uh oh. Definitely pissed off more of them. Oh, they die easily enough though, but um this is going to be a problem if I'm going to set myself on fire all the time. Can we put ourselves out in the water? Sort of. Sort of, but not really. As much as I love this weapon, I think I'm going to have to switch back to the regular plasma pistol. I think I am just too much of a hazard with something that's going to set fire to the ground. Ah, we did actually eat that. Okay. See, sometimes... I'm still trying to figure out, like, what's food and what isn't in this game. I also don't know if that's part of the background or if it... No, it doesn't come up high enough. But we know that there can be healing stuff inside those, so it's worth sort of having a look at. Oh jeez, yeah, everything's angry. So you're gone. Ah, oh, once he's down, you can't hurt him? Maybe. Yeah, that's what it looks like. So we're learning more about the... I want to say bad guys, but I'm not sure if they're the bad guys or if I'm the bad guy. We're learning more about the critters, the creatures that inhabit this uh, 
strange land. Let's push on this way and see what we get. <laughs> Feels a little bit slimy. There's more equipment up this way. Oh, jeez. One at a time. You're gone. And your friend is gone. Okay, we're still alright for... Am I supposed to go in here? I guess so. More equipment, but in a different place to last time. Or different style place, I should say. That's just a illuminating light thing. Most lights illuminate, of course. Alright, let's... Uh, Step down. Now I suspect this is going to be guarded like the other one. New auxiliary. We've already had a swarm before. But, uh, well, a, a different kind of swarm. This one's actually one that uh, gets released via the C key. I wish I had an automatic weapon. Okay, I think we've done... Oh, jeez, nope. So it's going to be like that, is it? Ow! Everything hurts. Right, can we get out now? Yes, we can. <laughs> you ever get the feeling that a place just wants to kill you? Yeah, I do sometimes. But we've uh, we've found that equipment, so let's uh, let's have a look at our map. That's this up here. Let's move on the other way. We are not doing massively well at the moment. We're down to 32 health. Down to 27 health. Ah! Okay, we can get a little bit of health back from you and you. I think pretty much everything in this place wants to kill us in one way or another. Oh dear. I hate not being able to see. Now there was more health back up here. I think we've recovered a little bit. You know what? Let's uh Let's see if we can get this pod eliminated. Get a little bit more health and put the grenade there. That didn't actually do anything and we could walk off that edge. So definitely not a secret there. Unless, like, it's a dive-through secret, but I don't think it's going to be. Not to worry. We'll find other things. Oh! That was close. And that was a very, very bad... Oh, come on! Got to be careful when uh, when dropping down from that. Uh, you do have air movement from the uh, the looks of it. So equipment's located over there. I wonder, can we do like a? Aha! Uh -huh. I'm learning. 
I'm learning. Dodge roll this way. Please give me some health. Yeah. Uh, Tesla injector. We will use that and we'll pick up the steroid injector. Ooh, flare revolver. Right. Let's uh, let's change weapon. We'll swap this for the flare gun. Low ammo capacity, slow fire rate. Chance to ignite enemies. But the flame doesn't persist, so I think I much prefer that. Now, there was more equipment up here. Let's actually have a look at our map. Yeah. I'm not convinced we're actually going anywhere safe. I'm also not convinced we're actually... Oh no, we are sort of on the map. And this game is weird. In a good way. So that might be another way up. Yeah, I think it is. Yeah, I quite like this flare gun. That low fire rate is going to be a bit of a problem. But it reloads quickly enough. Waited perfectly still for him to shoot me there. Maybe not the, uh, the best move that I've ever done. I think we're going to have to go up this one as well. That's alright, we've learned how this game works. Missed that bubble. Missed that bubble, let's try a bit further back. We were a bit too far forwards that time. Should be spot, yeah, spot on this time. And there's more going up that way. I'm assuming this hurts. Well, we can't get through it. Ha! Uh, using their grenades against them. Ow! That was a mistake. That was a big mistake. Setting myself on fire, not what I intended to do there. Okay, so we're going to try and go up and around this way. Missed. We'll try that again, but with a dodge roll. Okay. We can go up higher, but we'll go down here for the moment. And check out what's in here. Can't pick up! No, no, no! Oh, I can't even, like, see what it is. Disappointment is what it is. Now, am I stuck here, or... Yeah, I've got to go back this way. That's fine. What was the other thing? The Solus Hive. We've discovered that, so we don't need to do anything further. We can dodge this way, and we're going to walk up round. Nothing of note over this side. So let's go up and up again. Bubbles is a mean of, uh, means of transport. A form of transport probably made more famous by Sonic than uh, anything else that I can think of off the top of my head. Oh, it's a secret secret. And I can't pick it up. Ah! I really wish I knew what weapon that was. Okay, so we're at the top here. We're going to go back down and round. That'll be what our plan is. 
dodge roll in air does seem to slow our descent, so that's a good plan for the future. Doesn't always seem to work, though. Okay, are we back yet? Not quite. We could just go off this edge, I think. Nope, that's too far. Too far to fall. Let's go back the sensible way. And this way instead. Ooh, can't go back. That's going to be dangerous. I don't like having nowhere to retreat. <laughs> Flare revolver in your face. It's all painful. And there's more. Nope. <laughs> Wrong weapon for the situation. I probably should have changed over to the other one. I suspect that had uh, resistance to uh, being exploded. But still, that was uh, that was very interesting. Now, for for the future, we would have to ah, you can anything that hasn't mutated, you can click on to remove, or you can reset everything to start again. Ah. Okay, well, I think that's probably a good point for us to finish this episode here. Thank you very much for watching. I do hope you have enjoyed it. This is uh, this is Beacon, and uh, I'm definitely going to be doing more of it in the future. So do be sure to watch the channel. And if you haven't subscribed yet, uh, you should do so, and you'll be told when the next episodes go live. Likewise, if you are enjoying these videos, be sure to give me a thumbs up, and I'll see you next time for another episode. See you soon.